Hey friends, Rob here. I've tested positive for going to heaven. I've tested positive for having Jesus Christ in my life. And how can you know if you test positive? Well, the only way you can truly know is if you truly have asked the Lord Jesus to come into your heart. And obviously many people are perplexed right now from what's going on in the earth with this coronavirus. And obviously I'm in New York here and there's more cases here six times as many cases than at any other place in the United States. And the only way we can truly be safe from this virus or any plague or pestilence is having Jesus Christ in our life, especially if we do take our last breath, because eternity, my friend, is the most important thing. And how long is eternity? It's without measure. Is eternity a million years? Is it a billion times a billion years? Friends, eternity is without end. And Certainly no one's immortal under the sound of my voice, or at least I've never met somebody or anybody that is. And we're all going to take our last breath one day. Friends, the assurance and the assurance and the insurance that you need is that if you have Jesus in your life, the elevator will go up to where there's life insurance, and it won't go down to the basement, a place that Jesus Christ taught about in the Bible called hell, where you will need fire insurance. Am I trying to scare the hell out of you? But hopefully for some of you I am. And friends, if you've never invited Christ into your heart, you're only a prayer away. If you want to accept Jesus, he comes by invitation only. You control the doorknob to your heart. You can accept Christ out of obedience or reject him out of disobedience. In other words, if you keep the door closed when God knocks, well, I just made like I was knocking on a table, but actually the Bible says if you open the door when he knocks, he will come in and take residence and live in you. Say this simple prayer with me. Say, Jesus, thank you for dying on the cross for my sins. Thank you for being my Lord and Savior. God bless you if you prayed that prayer. I want to pray for you. Father, keep everyone under the sound of my voice safe from this virus, from any pestilence, deadly plague, any deadly disease, sickness, infirmity, in the mighty name of Jesus. Friends, the Lord loves you. Be blessed.